IONAV system is purchased. User should confirm the presence of the components packed in the safety carrier and inspect whether any abnormal external features are presented. Prepare in advance of any separately provided IONAV items and confirm the quantity in stock. Connect detector unit and control unit by using 25 pin cable provided. Make cable stable by using screw lock. In order to operate constant power unit, connect control unit to an external power supply unit after attaching adapter connector provided. Check green power state LED light of control unit when the power nozzle is connected to the socket. Four LED lights are on and off when detector unit operates normally. In order to operate battery mode, place fully charged Li-ion battery pack in a control unit and turn on the battery on-off switch. Press the power on-off button. Check green battery state unit 1, unit 2 LED lights when battery power is on in a control unit. 4 LED lights are on and off when detector unit operates normally. Select mode is shown on LCD screen after power is on. Press left button for negative mode and right button for positive mode of a detector unit. In order to heat up the oven system, warm up is needed. Welcome screen is shown when it is on. Orange LED is on and off on the right and service funk is displaying for 3 seconds. Orange LED is on and off on the right and heating is displaying for about 10-15 minutes. Green LED is on and off on the right and ready, and search is displaying when warm-up is done. Smear Mode Detection In order to open and let nozzle, move nozzle switch of a detector unit. Rub the surface of an object by using smear kit to gather the sample. Insert smear kit into the oven of a detector unit. Vapor Mode Detection To close and let nozzle, move nozzle switch of a detector unit backwards. Access the front part of nozzle to an object. Do a sampling for 5-8 seconds. In case of vehicle inspection, always primarily search where the driver and passengers mostly contact and the possible hiding place ace of hazardous substances. If the substances are hidden in the trunk of the vehicle, detection is successful using the machine search in most cases. To search on other parts, sampling of fingerprints on the handle or any grips that are frequently touched may be employed. Spots where traces of search items are most likely to be found. Around knots, cracks, gaps, and ventilation holes of the freight container. Lids, handles, near the pickup area, and spots within men's reach. Human-packed items. Spots where traces of explosive substances are most likely to present when searching the human body. Pockets. Around the belt around the clothing buttons, shoelaces and insults.